let's see how to do a quick presentation uh, when it is related to entrance gate which you are willing to design we can use the door tool from archicad and uh, it's a very simple technique which you can implement say for example when you dive inside the door tool you make sure that you use the sliding door and in that you can use this pocket double door or single depending on how this gate slides on single side or both side now you can decide some size of the gate as per your choice maybe i'll take this as a 4 meter by um, say 1800 cell to story instead of that i'll say cell to wall base and maybe this i'll take it as a 50 millimeter above the wall then uh, Obviously, the first page itself says wall over dimension, which I gave. Now, the second page, the door leaf, prior to that, this door frame, I am not going to use. And uh, then afterwards, you can choose for a simple grill, uh, see, the gate grill which you want to show, you can use this particular grill option. Uh, now, make sure that you can just fine tune these things further. So, maybe in this uh, door leaf type, the lower, upper and side, the frame widths. So, you can decide how, how this entire thing should work for you. These are the 200 mm as a bottom panel and the uh, left and right panel uh, is supposed to be 100 millimeter and 100 millimeter. So, it depends on the type of the metal uh, what you can say section which you are using then uh, what kind of a bars which you are willing to put in the design so thickness size I can say so I'll use the 12 by 12 or not 12 by 12 I can see this can be round about say uh, 20 by uh, say maybe 30 so it depends on how you want to go for and uh, vertical uh, divisions for the left and right panel and the horizontal divisions so maybe have vertical i can see 12 the right also i'll go for the same okay and the next page you can if in case handle i won't apply right now uh, okay so very quick setting for the surfaces i'll use a uniform surface as maybe a black color and uh, from then onward there's a leaf glass so just check out instead of the glass this time i will try to replace this with some wooden panel so maybe this uh, siding dark or light you can use or any other panel you can use uh, so this you can just try to replace so maybe this color is very light i'll just try to change it to the dark so you can understand how it goes okay so almost you have done with uh, the rest of thing you can fine tune on screen also so i'll just say okay and at the time of insertion make sure i have drawn one wall which is just hardly 50 millimeter in height even you can keep it zero as a height choose the appropriate anchor method and you can just make sure that you are targeted uh, this door that is nothing but gate is getting inserted on the right location now once this gate is inserted you can fine tune this further uh, say for example if in case you want to add those vertical supports which are helpful to place the guides which are essential to handle this gate so you can design this with a mark and uh, that can be get then added as per your choice so i'm just going to place this right now maybe for a while i'll place it over here you can fine tune this obviously now the point is how to place this your 
gate panel inside this slit which you have developed for the guide. So it's very simple. You can select your this uh, door and then you just have to play with the revel to all face value till it is not giving you the satisfactory result. So maybe it can be you can try with some basic value. Uh, okay, 50 is still not comfortable. So I might even end up with uh, see 90. Okay. So you can check out now this looks much better. And the point is now how to slide. Now it's a very simple thing. You just have to open this in 3D and that's it. Obviously, this location is not suitable, so I'll just try to drag this and take it to required location. So you can copy this on other side also, you can mirror it also. So that depends only on, on your convenience. So I'll just try to copy this on other side. Okay, and once it got copied, now uh, to open this, you can definitely either go inside the settings or identify the hotspot. And once the hotspot is there, you can just play with that. So as per your need, so maybe I'll just try to put as a one two zero zero as my opening width in two D, and uh, that's it. So. A very simple technique probably I can see to show the presentation which is related to sliding gate uh, for your compound wall. Instead of solid panels for this uh, gate, if you want to keep them as a transparent, that is just the grid for the uh, horizontal and vertical bars, uh, it's very easy. You can just go inside this uh, leaf uh, glass material and here you can just say that this works as an air as your material or surface and that's it. When you say okay, you can check out now. This looks quite simple and uh, even if you add the shadows by checking your sun direction and if you just go inside your 3d style settings and if you just say sun shadow you can see how this shadows are getting created the way you expect for the grill which you have designed